It's mutant bobblehead day for the first 10,000 fans with extra limbs here at Three Mile Island Stadium here in Steeltown, Pennsylvania. I got seven extra knuckles, Grim. Hey, extra fingers and toes don't count. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for NFL action. The New York Prince take on the Blitzburg Steelheads. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hello again, everybody. Grim Blitzrow here along with Brickhead Mulligan. That's me. And his mutant hobbit head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. How about you shut the fuck up? Well played, Jr. Moving on. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. It's about a three yard pickup. And that'll bring up second and one. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. And I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed thing, Grim. He's running from his game, it's clear. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a frog in my head. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Whenever a player gets big like this, it reminds me of that Tom Hanks movie. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. Second down and six. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Calls the thunderclap dirty trick. Man, that's gotta hurt. Then I make the hair on your corpse stand straight up. The 20. He's at the 10. And one saver there.
First down and seven. So much for the bombs way dirty trick on that play. Didn't fool the defense for a second. Second down and seven. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Third and four. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your ass. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, his head just exploded. What a miss, what a miss. Ah, oh, shit. And this is a first and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And he just slipped away like a crease. Oh, shut sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. First and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with softballs. 
He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Second down and a lot. <laughs> Spike the offensive water with Strawberry Fields. And now they can taste sound, but can't remember what the concept of time is. Sounds like new everything. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Injection. Now watch him stop all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. Bricks. Yeah, tell him me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. <laughs> and he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nice. Another bullshit penalty. How long are these guys going to take this? First. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> First down and forever. like Thor on a revenge bender. Oh, he took a leap and had the ball knocked out. Fumble! He's got a case of fumbleitis. He's at the 20. The 10. He did it! He scores! And with that amazing run, he bursts through the end zone for six. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you music out. That's right. What you talking about? So they're going for two. Bam! Gutsy run for the conversion. Ah, uh, this just breaks my heart, man. First robot to place humans on assembly lines and cars and, and soldiers, and now it's dancers. What's the world coming to, Grim? I ask you honestly, what is the world coming to? The same radioactive wasteland it's been for a while, Brick. 
When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot eight. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe with a headache. Third down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. He had it for a second there. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Oh, he almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big portage on in here. We're a freaking fracking accident waiting to happen. And he takes a time out here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And they take their last timeout. It's between them and the clock now, Grim. Well, and the defense, too. And it's first and ten. Call me turkeys on Thanksgiving. Cleats are kicked and blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. And they stop the clock 
with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blast for me. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Brick. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And that's a catch for three yards. Second down and seven. Hey, timeouts are kind of like condoms, you know, Grim? You got to use them smart if you want to score. Let's see if they did. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. Welcome back to the start of the second half. It's a close game and should be a battle to the end. The teams line up for the kickoff. And my second half buzz is just kicking in right on time. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. Too fast. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. point but you never know with kickers <laughs> it goes right through yeah like a double stop burrito from taco hell here comes the kickoff let's see if the defense can hold them just catch it run it back and don't die First and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down and long. And that is a big game. You know the defense wants some payback after that. And that'll bring him third down in inches. Oh man, what a throw! That sonic blast just cleared the field for the result. Holy mother of mutant mayhem! He scored! Is bad. My floor wizard vacuum bot has better moves. I think 
Put my vacuum a lot, Grim. That's not wrong, is it? It is when you make a dinner and buy perfume, you pervert. <laughs> Only on a birthday! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. That's a gain of 10 yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Man, what a hit that was! And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. night there was a big explosion and then everyone left disappointed what do you mean everyone third down and ten hot hot one hot two and then a first down from a great catch was it a catch and the ref is picking up a wad of singles as he runs off the field how do you think he got those grim didn't you see him stripping on the sidelines He's bribed, you idiot. Third down and long. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. four-yard gain. Third down and, well, good luck. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Now 
do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a console was at home. Hey, hey, what you talking about? And it's first and ten. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. Second down in a very lot. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, NFL. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Friends. Their marketing team hates it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. The nastiest dirty trick in the NFL is Chase on Mass. The ten. And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run! here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room it's good they need a good return here to set up the offense 
He's gonna be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. First and ten. They've used a Troy Fields dirty trick, and the defense holds that pass play to only two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard. First and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Third down and nine. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Kick it. In that order, Grim? That was a lightning fast move there, Bricks. Unfortunately for him, the lightning was even faster. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing. But their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. He's got his beast boost working. Devastating. Rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And he scores. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm not too fast. Enough. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing.
And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Second down, smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or trying to ref some cash. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call. And he made a mistake there, throwing, oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. And this guy's an electrifying player even when he's not getting electrocuted. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. Not much there, maybe a yard. And the defense uses their second timeout to stop the clock to preserve time for their offense. Third down and five. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And that's their last timeout. The defense can't bend or break. They've got to get a stop here. And it's first and ten. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! And big deal. Missed the beat for Brace Ram with a ball and didn't fall down. Seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. <laughs> the Steelheads are losers today. The score says it all, but it wasn't even that close. They got blown out at home. Fans left the game and start watching new game of bones on NBO. You know, I watched that on my phone, too. Let's go down to the field and see how badly the MVP rubs it in. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.